friends, it's Gloria from Golden Bucket Farm. I'm Jersey Lady, or rather the Jersey Lady One on YouTube. And I'm here sharing some bargains that I got while I was shopping this morning. We live out in the country and so you know it's it's uh we don't run to town shopping just just so often, so um, I needed, I went to Hobby Lobby, first of all, and I had a, my 40% coupon and I needed some tacky glue, so I got the clear gel this morning, so that was a good deal. What is it? $2.99, so a dollar and a half, good deal. And then um, I needed some cardstock, and they had their paper studio and some other of their papers 50% uh, off, so I got a package of um, the heavyweight cardstock is a little bit heftier than the regular cardstock that they have. So, yay for that! This is eight and a half by eleven fifty pack for eight ninety nine. So four fifty, good deal. Then, um, Paper Crafter forty five. Uh, thank you, thank you, dear, uh, shared with me some uh, papers uh, recently, and one of them was a, a fabric um, paper. Uh, had fa uh, fabric adhered to it, and it was a peachy, peachy and creamy print of, like, little froggies in a pond, and, um, the... Oh, what are the lily? Water lilies. <laughs> Think about it. Water lilies and cattails and, and like that. Just a, a real pretty little print, but I really it's in a peach era tone. And I really didn't have anything in my stash that would kind of work to work with that. And then I remembered the last time I had been at Hobby Lobby, they had this uh, collection. This is again a paper studio uh, collection called Beach House, and it has lots of peaches in it. Well, <laughs> yeah, we wish. It is peach season now. Um, but peach-colored papers, and so I thought that some of these would work just real well and uh, for, that, uh, for that project of using that papers to make boxes or whatever I want to do. Um, I'm trying to see how I can turn this with the light so that's the best. But... Just, there are some really nice papers. Now, granted, this collection, when 180 pages for $19.95, or in my case for uh, $10 today, uh, this isn't graphic 45 paper, but just some real nice, usable, workable papers that I can have a lot of fun for $10. Some nice stripes and some, uh, well, it's actually a check that could work like a grid. Some nice wovens, postmarks, some stripes, maps. There's some nice seahorses, just kind of nice graphics uh, of all sorts of sea creatures. There's some prints in there. There are um, florals, too. Some nice, almost like stucco or sand. Um, yeah, let me see if I can just... What I really liked in here, especially, I don't know if I can find it. Um, there's some wood pieces. There's one, and there's three, and sometimes four of a, of a kind as I've worked through here. Um, yeah, anyway, that was a happy, there's one of the woods that I really, I think I could make good use of, and there's one where the wood is really weathered with paint, up here in the beginning, there's some wovens, oh, I like this rock. So anyway, I don't know if I can find that. It's sort of like, um, you know, oh, there it is. Really weathered wood with old 
uh, like teal paint peeling off of it. So yeah, there's some nice burlap and more maps. Yeah, anyway, I think, oh, there's a nice one with raveled fabric. Um, I think I can, oh, some nice shells. So yeah, anyway, if you need something in the, in the creams, peach cream, uh, teal, kind of bright green, and then, and then some really nice, um, photographic prints of naturals on um, this beach house might be just right up your alley. The other thing I got today, um, I went to Myers and that's M-E-I-J-E-R. Uh, you can go to Meyer.com, but it's, it's kind of like, um, a little step up from Walmart here in the middle Midwest and uh, groceries and, you know, one of those everything, big everything stores. And they had their, all their nice knit, um, jammies and nighties on sale today. So I got a nice pink, I already put it, put it into the wash, you know, for, for the first time before I wear it. But, um, while my husband was kind of pushing around in the grocery department, I went to look to see what I could find in the, in the craft. Of course, and they had their um, smash the smash book stuff um, all marked down. And these, these are, I love those smash pins. These are the black ones, and with the glue on the end. And this was two fifty nine, and now they were a dollar twenty nine. So I can make use of those for my day book. And I use oh different adhesives, but this is um, Elmer's Craft Bond Extra Strength, and that too was $249.24 now, so that went in my basket. So you might look if, you know, that's something you use. And then um, the quick dry with the, the skinny point and the wide point, so I don't know, that was a dollar. I think that was the last one. It was kind of bent up, but anyway, yay. That was, that was good bargains today. And then... The best of all, save for last, you got to love Martha Stewart. Here she is. This is the double-edged punch that is the um, eyelet lace. And I saw this at Hobby Lobby for $19.99. I think it was originally at a Myers for $15.99. It was marked down to $11 something and Today I got it for $7.99, so yay, that was a good, that was a really good bargain, and um, I don't always, like I say, we don't always run to town just on a whim or just because the Joann's ad appears in the mailbox or online or something, but when I do go, I'm always happy if I can um, save a little bit, so this put a smile on my on my bargain hunter's face today so um what else do i have to share i guess just happy crafting and um, I, oh i have some craft videos to make of some projects that i've made recently and um so i'll see you soon happy crafting bye bye